And in the world of computing, we all care about our important information that are contained in our files. We take pictures, record videos, and do the audio recordings to ensure that our memories are kept safe. But in some cases, our files get broken and corrupted during some processes, and we no longer be able to access our files as expected. If you're having the same issue, don't get frustrated. Be here with me for this short journey and you'll see on how to resolve that. Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, my name is Chris aka the IT guy. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix the broken or corrupted files by using simple steps that I'm going to show you. After trying many software and failed, today I'm going to try the Wondershare Repair It software to see if it will get the job done. Wondershare Repair It is a special repair software that can be used to repair the broken and corrupted files in different formats like MP4, like JPEG, like PNG and many more. And before you continue, here are some of the possible reasons why a file can get corrupted or be broken, including malware or viruses, damage the file header, issues caused by a copy from one device to another one, the network interruption during downloading, the compression issues and the editing, wrong file extension, and many more. Let's go on the official website to grab the copy of the software to get started. And you can go in the description, there will be the first link that will be there that can be used to direct you to the official website on your computer let me jump to my computer so as to show you what's going on guys so on your computer you can go ahead and open your web browser in this case i'm going to use chrome that is my favorite and in the chrome search bar you can go ahead and type one as share repair it like this one and press enter and there will be a lot of links from the search results but the link that we are aiming for is this the second link from the search results and it is repairit.wandershare.com that is now the official website and as I told you you can find this link in the description and you can click on there and you'll be redirected to in this case let me go and click on here after clicking on here I will be redirected to the repairit page and you can see that it is compatible with windows and mac os and the other feature that i liked about about this one is it can offer you a free version and a paid version but for a better experience and and better efficiency of what you are going to do i'm going to try the paid version and here are some of the files that it can, it can support and without further ado let's go ahead and click on try it for free uh, for windows because i'm using a windows you can try it for free on mac and i'm going to press on ok and the download is complete now you can go ahead and press on open to start the setup installation and the installation is very straightforward there is no uh, hard thing in there and you can go ahead and press on install so it will start installation it doesn't talk along so you have to wait and as now the installation is complete you can go ahead and click on start now so as to start the software and to redirect you to this page to ask you to buy for license which is good if you want to use it as a full version like i told you so i'm going to go ahead and see how now it is you can see that the offers three options to repair the video to repair the photo and to repair any other specific files that it supports but for the better experience i'm going to go ahead and log in and you can see that i have logged in my account and you have seen that i have purchased all these licenses so i'm going to go ahead and add a file so i'm going to start by trying to recover the video but before we do that i will have to show you a sample of the file on how they look like when they are corrupted so in this folder uh, there is some of the files that i have so i'm going to try to open one of my mp4 for example when i try to open this one you can see that it has the issues you can see that it cannot be laid so i'm going to close this and try the the fix process so i'm going to go back in the software click on the add button and i will be directed to this folder and i'm going to browse for my proper location it is on desktop and choose my files where is they my files and i will choose mp4 and i will choose this one video and when you try to repair it so let's see when you try to repair it like this one you can see that there will be a possibility that the simple repair will not work and after these fairies we can try the advanced one and we will try to sample a video so as to be able to repair it and the sample video that are, that we can use to fix this one it can be taken from the same device or they have been copied in the same folder but this one seems to be not working so when you click on the advanced repair 
we will take a short moment to analyze the video and after it will ask us to add a sample video as i told you the sample video will be the video from the same device or the video from the same folder on where you copied all the videos at the same time so i'm going to go ahead and press on this folder icon and I'll choose this as my sample video and i will try to press next and we have to wait for a couple of seconds for this one to be complete and once it's completed you can go ahead and press on repair and wait for a short moment and it will be successful if you are lucky enough oh boom and you can see that it was able to to repair my video here when you try to preview the video you can see that you can also be able to to preview the video like really good and you can go ahead and close this you can go ahead and save this video as now the the proper working video and i'm going to choose for example i'm going to put it on my local disk d and press on save and after saving you can see that the preview of the video it will now work for this time and that was for the video so let's go ahead and try to give it a shot to the photos so as i was showing you the broken videos let's let me try to show you the broken photos too for example i have my jpeg here folder i can try to open this one you can see that it's now an invalid image but when you try to do the, uh, the repair process it will be as a good as a, an original one so i'm going to go on photo repair i will try to add a photo and browse where it is on desktop my files again and jpeg and i will choose this one it was the first and i'm going to click on repair and wait for a couple of seconds and boom here you can see now the photo is also uh, saved so i can go ahead and save this and it was repaired and i'm going to save on the local disk d and when you press on ok you can see that now i can see the preview of my photo like this one as expected this marks the end of this video i hope you guys you find this very interesting and useful you can give it a shot whenever you have broken files or corrupted files and i hope you will get the better results like i did and let me know in the comments if you guys have any problem about these processes that we were doing and if you're coming on the channel for the first time make sure you subscribe and hit like that like button if you like this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.